In Love Next Door, Young Hae-in's portrayal of Choi Sung-hyo was anticipated to be another successful venture, especially with the established expectation that his character would share a deep, childhood-rooted friendship with Young Soo Min's character. However, the on-screen chemistry between the two actors fell short of these expectations. Despite both being talented and well-loved actors, the connection between Young Hae-in and Young Soo Min didn't seem to spark the emotional intensity that viewers had hoped for. Fans were quick to point out that their interactions lacked the natural fluidity often seen in compelling romantic or emotional pairings. For those who had high hopes for this drama, it was a letdown to witness such a disconnect between two characters that were supposed to have a long, shared history. As a fan, one can't help but wonder, what went wrong? Could it have been the writing, the direction, or simply a mismatch in the actor's chemistry? The criticism directed at Love Next Door wasn't limited to the actors alone. The storyline itself was met with harsh reviews, with many calling it predictable and uninspired. Audiences remarked that the plot was too reminiscent of older dramas, with little innovation to keep them engaged. It felt like the drama was trapped in a time loop of recycled tropes and predictable scenarios. In a landscape filled with fresh and dynamic content, Love Next Door seemed outdated, making it hard for viewers to stay invested. The lack of chemistry between Young Hae-in and Young Soo Min only added to the drama's woes, leaving many wondering if a stronger script could have made their pairing more believable. Or was the lack of a strong connection between the leads a sign of deeper issues that no amount of plot tweaking could fix? The film's failure serves as a reminder that even with talented actors, a lackluster script can spell doom for a production. It makes us reflect on how much potential was wasted here, what if they had been given a stronger narrative to work with, in stark contrast to Love Next Door, Young Hae-in's earlier project Something in the Rain stands as one of the most significant highlights of his career. In fact, this drama did more than just boost his profile, it became a cultural phenomenon across Asia. Viewers were captivated by the tender yet intense love story between Young Hae-in and Sun Yi Jin's characters, with the drama's depiction of romance feeling incredibly authentic and emotionally charged. The undeniable chemistry between the two stars was palpable in every scene, particularly in the romantic moments that had fans swooning. One of the most memorable aspects of Something in the Rain was its steamy romantic scenes, which garnered much attention. These scenes were so well acted that they led to widespread rumors about whether Young Hae-in and Sun Yi Jin were actually dating in real life. This is the kind of on-screen magic that transcends fiction, making viewers question the reality behind what they see. Could their undeniable connection be real? The speculation about a possible off-screen romance between Young Hae-in and Sun Yi Jin persisted long after Something in the Rain ended with many fans eager to know the truth. Adding to the intrigue, during the filming of Love Next Door, Young Hae-in subtly referenced Sun Yi Jin in one of his lines, a moment that didn't go unnoticed by the audience. It was a small but significant nod, one that reignited discussions about their relationship and whether there was something more than just professional camaraderie between them. These moments, where reality seems to blur with the fiction of their roles, are what make fan speculation so much fun to follow. What if that brief mention was more than just a clever callback? Could it have been a subtle acknowledgement of their shared history on screen, or perhaps a playful inside joke, one of the more charming moments in the ongoing narrative of their supposed relationship occurred during the 2020 Bexang Awards. In a now-famous interaction, Young Hae-in was seen greeting Sun Yi Jin during a break, patiently waiting as she checked herself in a mirror. The simple, gentlemanly gesture made fans swoon, with many commenting on the natural ease between the two. These small interactions only fueled more rumors about their off-screen relationship. Especially given how well they had connected during the filming of Something in the Rain. Fans were eager to interpret every little glance or gesture, wondering if there was more to their bond than met the eye. Was this just a polite gesture between colleagues, or did it hint at a deeper connection between the two? The fact that fans continued to dissect these moments speaks to the powerful on-screen chemistry they shared. But amidst all the rumors surrounding Young Hae-in and Sun Yi Jin, another figure loomed large, Hyun Bin. As Sun Yi Jin's eventual husband, Hyun Bin's reactions to the constant speculation about her relationship with Young Hae-in became a subject of intense public interest. During interviews, when asked about the dating rumors between Sun Yi Jin and her co-star, Hyun Bin's discomfort was noticeable. In one particular interview, he even turned away, appearing uneasy when the topic of something in the rain was brought up. This reaction led fans to speculate that Hyun Bin might have felt jealous or even threatened by the strong chemistry between Sun Yi Jin and Young Hae-in. 
It's fascinating to think about how the roles these actors play on screen can sometimes influence real-life emotions. Could Hyun-bin have been silently harboring feelings for Sun Yijin all along, even as she captivated audiences with her on-screen romance with Yoong Hae-in, Hyun-bin's visible discomfort during these interviews only added to the growing theory that he had feelings for Sun Yijin long before they publicly confirmed their relationship. Fans were quick to interpret his body language, suggesting that his jealousy over the scenes in Something in the Rain was a clear sign of his affection. And indeed, when Hyun Ben and Sun Yi Jin eventually went public with their relationship, fans looked back at all the subtle hints and interactions, believing that the writing had been on the wall all along. It's fascinating how, in retrospect, every interview and every gesture becomes loaded with meaning. Could it be that Hyun Bin's discomfort with the romantic scenes in Something in the Rain was because he had already fallen for Sun Yi Jin? Fans certainly seem to think so, even though Something in the Rain remains a professional highlight for Yoong Hae-in. The public's fascination with his relationship with Sun Yi Jin continues to linger. Despite Sun Yi Jin's eventual marriage to Hyun Bin, many fans still hold on to the possibility that Yoong Hae-in and Sun Yi Jin might have shared something special. It's a testament to the power of on-screen chemistry when even years later, fans are still talking about the possibility of a romance between two actors. In truth, this kind of speculation shows just how invested people become in the lives of their favorite stars, blurring the lines between fiction and reality. And for Young Hae-in, his connection with Sun Yi Jin, both on and off-screen, remains one of the defining elements of his career. Ultimately, Something in the Rain solidified Young Hae-in's position as a leading actor in the world of romantic dramas. The incredible chemistry he shared with Sun Yi Jin not only captivated audiences, but also ensured the drama's success across Asia. Even though their real-life relationship was never confirmed, the rumors and speculation only added to the mystique surrounding the drama. It's fascinating to see how a single project can leave such a lasting impact, not just because of the storyline, but because of the emotional connections formed between the actors and the audience. What a legacy, Something in the Rain has left behind, both for Young Hae-in and for the fans who continue to adore this unforgettable pairing. Chemistry is crucial in acting, one of the key takeaways is how important on-screen chemistry is in determining the success of a project. Despite the talents of Young Hae-in and Young Soo min the lack of strong interaction between them and Love Next Door led to disappointment among fans. This highlights how critical it is for actors to create authentic and compelling relationships in their roles, especially when portraying close or romantic ties, script quality matters, a strong script can elevate performances, while a weak one can diminish even the best efforts of actors. Love Next Door suffered not only because of the lack of chemistry between the leads, but also due to its outdated and unoriginal storyline. This shows how essential it is for the narrative to engage the audience with fresh and dynamic content. On-screen success can lead to real-life speculation, the immense success of Something in the Rain not only elevated Young Hae-in's career but also sparked long-lasting rumors about his relationship with Sun Yi Jin. This reflects the audience's tendency to blur the line between fiction and reality, often projecting romantic storylines onto the actors' personal lives, fan fascination with celebrities' personal lives. The persistent interest in the rumored relationship between Young Hae-in and Sun Yi Jin, along with Hyun Bin's visible discomfort during interviews, demonstrates the public's intense curiosity about celebrity relationships. Fans enjoy analyzing body language, interactions, and off-screen moments to fuel their speculation about real-life romances.